hi everyone welcome back and for those of you who are new here welcome to my channel so today's video is going to be another very exciting haul video um, I actually wanted to include all these things in my earlier haul video but I couldn't because they came a lot later if I had actually done that it would have been like a really really big one so I kind of decided to break it up into two parts so if you'd like to see all the makeup that I bought then please keep watching one of my good friends had a friend of hers coming down from the UK and uh, she asked me if I wanted to order anything from there so there's this um, UK website that I absolutely love it's called Beauty Bay so I ordered a few things from Beauty Bay so I'll just show you what I got from there the first thing that I bought from Beauty Bay is this Morphe palette. Now this is the 35OS palette. For those of you who are familiar with Morphe, you'll know that they have a lot of these palettes that have like 35 eyeshadows in it. Originally I wanted to get the 35O palette um, but that one was out of stock and they also have a 35OM palette which is all matte shades but this one is a 35OS which which means that they have all shimmer shades and if you don't know from my earlier videos I'm all about shimmery shades I absolutely love them I'm just gonna open up this palette and show you what it looks like so this is what the palette looks like and I'm just gonna open it up and this is what it looks like so all these shades are shimmery shades I'm a huge fan of like these warm colors and I absolutely love all these shades I think they work really well for my skin tone so yeah I'm really really excited to try out this palette the next thing that I got from Beauty Bay is this clear lash adhesive by Ardell now um, Ardell makes really good lashes and really good lash glues I thought I'd pick this up because I knew that I wanted to get some um, false lashes as well so this one is supposed to be a really really good one I also ordered some stuff for um, another friend of mine BH Cosmetics palette and some LA girl stuff and because um, our order was I think above a certain amount uh, I also got a couple of makeup geek eyeshadows I chose two colors this one is bitten and this one is anarchy and they are really really pretty they are like these um, um, plum kind of shades I'll just open them up and show you they are quite similar but I think uh, bitten is a little bit darker bitten is a little bit darker than anarchy and uh, bitten is matte whereas anarchy is a little um, shimmery and I really really love both these colors and I can't wait to try out some eye looks with them so next I ordered a few products from Sleek. I already had a few of their products and I really really like them. So I thought I'd order a few more. I really like the way they've uh, packaged their products. It comes in like this really nice um, matte cardboard box with stitch makeup on the front. So I think it's quite nice. And when you open up the box, I'll just show you. It has like this pink tissue paper. It's just like these little touches that make um, ordering makeup all the more exciting. The first thing I got is this contour palette. It's a cream contour palette and I got it in the shade dark. This is what the palette looks like. Um, I really like that the pan size is really big. It's got three uh, highlighting shades and three contour shades and I think all of them will work pretty well for my skin tone. So this one is the darkest one and these two are slightly lighter and I guess it depends on whether you're going for a very subtle contour or a very striking one. So depending on that you can choose your contour shade and uh, I think even the concealer shades would uh, work well for my skin tone so can't wait to try this one out so the next thing that I got from sleek are these liquid lipsticks so these are the matte me ultra smooth lipsticks and this one is in the shade vino tinto and the other one is in the shade velvet slipper I absolutely adore both these shades and I can't wait to see how they look on my lips so I do have a couple of other shades of these sleek matte me lipsticks uh, one is in the shade birthday suit and the other one is in the shade 
shabby chic so this one is birthday suit and this one is shabby chic and I really like the formula of these lipsticks in fact I think they were one of the first um, companies to come up with these matte lipsticks and these matte me lipsticks are quite uh, popular these days so in color has them and I think ADS has them and also another brand called Swiss Beauty so they've all got the idea I think from sleek so um, I really really like these and the last thing I got is this highlighting palette this one is in the shade Cleopatra's kiss and I just want to show you what the packaging looks like inside if you can see it is the most beautiful gold packaging in fact I'm actually getting like dirty fingerprints all over the the pretty packaging so yeah this packaging looks really really sleek and uh, really really high-end and when you open it up these are the shades inside they are so so pretty um, there are two powder um, highlighters and two cream so these two are powder and these two are cream highlighters they are very very pretty and um, from the reviews that I've seen and the videos that I've watched I kind of gauged that this particular shade uh, Cleopatra's Kiss would suit my skin tone well so I just hope that I was right so yeah I'm very excited about this uh, highlighting palette I keep saying I'm very excited about all this makeup but it's actually true new makeup gets me so so excited so whenever i get new stuff i just can't wait to like try it out but i know that i have to be patient and kind of do a video and show you guys what i got and only then will i um will i go ahead and like bring my brushes into the palettes and try them out so yeah i'm very very excited for all these things and you're probably going to hear me saying uh, that I'm very excited for everything so sorry about that in advance next I also made a purchase from uh, cult beauty which is another UK website and they happen to be offering free shipping during a particular period and I would heard about this next brand a lot from um, various youtubers and one of them actually named Wayne Goss made this brand so so popular that it was so difficult to get these products and I was hunting around online trying to get these products and I finally got my hands on the ones that I wanted so I'm just going to show them to you right now so these are the products they are by a brand called the ordinary and ordinary is actually a skincare brand but they make a couple of primers and a couple of foundations which i really wanted to try out and uh, i think because they were so hyped up and they were so popular that it was um, really difficult to get a hold of them and there was like a long waiting period then um, every time i kind of checked cult beauty um, it was always um, that I had to join the wait list and wait and wait and wait until finally I saw these in stock and it happened to be them offering free shipping so I jumped at the chance and ordered like a bunch of things and um, I actually ordered the primers first and then the foundations and when I ordered the, the primers um, they were shipped out immediately and the foundations came back in stock so I ordered that as well and even though it said free shipping for some reason I was getting charged for shipping so I emailed the customer care at uh, Cult Beauty and they were so so nice they actually told me you know go ahead and place your order and send us your invoice and we will actually reimburse you the shipping fee if you're having trouble you know on our website but luckily once I refreshed everything um, it didn't charge me for shipping so yeah that, I'm very excited about that and yeah so these are the products that I got so I got the ordinary high spreadability fluid primer I got the ordinary high adherence silicone primer I also got the coverage foundation which is supposed to be a high coverage foundation and I got the serum foundation now these two foundations I got in the shade 3.0 Y again I did a bunch of research and you know try to gauge what my foundation um, shade would be because I couldn't again try these in person so I really hope they match me um, I think they will actually uh, so I can't wait to try these out I will be doing a complete review on all these products so look out for that video so moving on my husband and I actually took a weekend trip to Bombay and whenever I go to Bombay I am 
so excited because I just love the city and also um, it's an opportunity for me to buy new makeup which is a little bit difficult to get here so I like going to like the local stores and buying um, makeup there so like the local brands and things like that which I know work well for me so I'm always very excited to um, go to Bombay I put all the stuff in this big Amazon box here so let's just get started with that okay so first off I went to Alpha in Villa Parle and for those of you who don't know Alpha is like this chain of stores that has everything from um, clothes to mobile phones to makeup and their makeup store is fantastic so if you have a chance to go to Alpha then definitely visit that place you will find a lot of makeup products like Miss Claire, Sivana Colors and all the other stuff that's really hard to find you'll find it at Alpha so that's definitely a must visit place on my list whenever I go to Bombay. From Alpha I got um, this duo lash adhesive now again I knew that I wanted to get um, false lashes so I got the Ardell one and I thought I'd try this one out as well next I bought the in color cosmetics um, gel liner it's supposed to be a waterproof gel eyeliner and I got it in the shade jet black um, again I've heard lovely things about this eyeliner so that I thought I'd check it out for those of you who have watched my earlier makeup um, beginners makeup kit video you'll know that I think Miss Claire blushes are really really affordable um, this one is in the shade 13 and was actually on my list of blushes to buy so can't wait to test this one out hey guys so I'm really sorry but my um, my battery just died so um, I decided to film the rest of this video a few hours later which is why the lighting um, is a little bit off next I also got a Miss Claire soft matte lip cream and I think they've come up with a whole new range of colors um, because I haven't seen this one before this is the number 55 and the tester that the sales girl showed me um, it seemed like a really really nice nude color I'm really fond of nude lipstick so I have to get this one I also wanted to try out the Sivana colors um, eyebrow pencil it's the waterproof eyebrow pencil in the shade misty brown now this one was really really affordable it was only 50 rupees I wanted to try this one out as well and for those of you that have watched my um, my makeup tip video on how to customize your own lipstick um, you would know that I really really like the Miss Claire um, lip pencils now I got them in a huge range of shades because they were really really affordable these were only like 35 rupees each so I got the shade shine rose chocolate lovely pink bobby brown choosy cherry red wine snow pink coffee brown this one is romantic pink another one in snow pink because it's a really nice um, nude lip pencil and one called rust now I got a mixture of like berries and browns from light brown to dark brown and nude colors um, just so that I have like backups in case I ever need them so I found these really affordable so I decided to pick up a whole bunch next I also went to beauty center beauty center is a really nice place to pick up uh, brands like um, in color and some Miss Claire stuff and a lot of other local brands as well so I'll just show you the things that I picked up from Beauty Center first up I picked up the Tony and Guy heat protection mist now I do blow dry and iron my hair when it gets like really frizzy or when I want to have like a nice um, sleek look I was on the lookout for a good protection spray because um, I know it's really important to like um, use the right kind of heat protection products um, especially if you have dry hair and I've heard a lot about this particular one so I thought I'd check it out um, I will do a review on maybe on my Instagram about how this has worked out for me so uh, keep a lookout for that one the next thing I got is this Vega eyelash curler and I also got um, a slanting tweezer from Vega to help me apply my false lashes those were all the things that I got from beauty center 
Next, I also went to Beautiful, which is another store that I like to visit when I'm in Bombay. And I picked up this highlighting brush from that store. It's by a brand called Brushman. It's a professional makeup br fan brush. So I'm, I'm, I haven't heard about this brand before, so I was eager to try it out. So let's see how this works. And finally, I went to the PAC store. Um, I absolutely love PAC, but so far I haven't really tried any of the other stuff except for their brushes. Um, so I was very excited to try out some more things from there. I got a whole bunch of their false eyelashes. I've heard really good things about these lashes. Got them in the number 53, 55, 213, 51, and 54. So they have a whole bunch of their lashes on display and you can kind of choose what you want. So I picked up the most natural looking ones, um, mainly because I just want to try them out and see how good they are. So I'm very, very excited about these. So the next thing that I picked up from PAC is this eyeshadow brush. Now I have a bunch of their face brushes and a few um, eye brushes as well. So I really wanted to try this one out. It's in the number 367 and it's their eyeshadow application brush. So very excited to try this one out. So I've also heard a lot about their retro matte glosses. So I picked up two of them. This is in the shade 43 Chocolate Martini, which is a really nice um, brown shade. And uh, this one is in the shade 39. It's called the Grind. And this was also a really, really pretty shade. The nice thing there is that they let you kind of take your time and test out their testers and the colors to see which ones you want. They're very, very helpful. And I will definitely visit that store again. I really, really like their stuff. So yeah, these are the two retro matte glosses that I picked up. That was all the makeup that I got from Bombay. And now I'll just show you a few things that I got from Nykaa. Now Nykaa recently launched Wet n Wild, which is a very, very affordable makeup brand that is available in the US. And I was so happy when I found out that they'd come to India because I absolutely love Wet n Wild. I think their products are A, super affordable and B, really good quality. So I couldn't wait to try out some some things from there and my sister was a real sweetheart and she got me this uh, liquid catsuit lipstick in the color Missy and Fierce it's a beautiful red and um, she knew how much I wanted it so she ordered that for me I have a couple of other shades so I know that the formula is really really nice um, another one that she got me is the wet n wild mega last lipstick and this is in the shade sugar plum fairy this one i have been waiting for for the last three years i kid you not every time i tried to get this particular color i it just never happened and it got so much that i was like dying for this color so she knew how badly i wanted it and uh, she very sweetly picked it up for me um i cannot wait to try this one out and now that i finished this haul video i'm definitely gonna try this color out um i'm so so excited about this particular lipstick finally the one palette that i've been waiting for for so long i was very very excited about this one and this is the jacqueline hill morphe palette now a little bit of backstory about how i got this palette it was such a coincidence actually now another friend of mine had another of her friends coming down from the uk and she asked me if i wanted to order again something else um, I think they all know how difficult it is to find products here in India so um, she was kind enough to offer to bring down something for me um, and I really wanted this palette but every time I went on Beauty Bay or any other website to try and find it for some reason it was always out of stock it was now I understand that it's a really really popular palette but it was ridiculous like every single time I tried to get it it was out of stock so um, I finally gave up and I told her you know what it's okay but thank you very very much for being so sweet um, to offer to bring something down for me but um, it's okay never mind I will just maybe order it another time so one fine day I was scrolling through Instagram and I found this post from Morphe now I follow them on Instagram and they had put up this post saying that uh, they had opened up a new UK website so when I heard that I was like 
oh my god can I order the palette now so I went ahead and placed an order for this palette and I was so happy when it got confirmed and delivered and I couldn't wait for um, my friend's friend to come down so yeah so that's how I got this palette um, if you head on over to my Instagram you'll see that I've uh, taken a picture of it I posted it up and my husband was very very sweet to get it for me so thank you so much to him and with that we come to the end of this very long haul video i know um thank you so much for watching if you like this video then please give it a big thumbs up down below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel hit the little bell icon beside the subscribe button so you'll be notified every time i upload a new video thank you so much for watching i will see you in my next video bye